Hi everybody, Ken from Oz here with another Filofax tip. Well, I've got a little confession to make. Um, in my earlier videos I was discussing how I wanted to have my Filofax fairly free of decoration. And if you go through um, with looking at my weekly uh, work and page, you can see it's a lot of writing, post-it notes, and basically that's it. However, my confession for you at YouTube and the people watching this video is that I have I have actually gone and bought myself some stickers. Now, I have to explain the reason for that. Being an educator, I do use stickers occasionally to reward students as a positive in, um, indication that they've done a good job and uh, we're encouraged at the school that I work to actually use this form of uh, um, complimenting students and and I don't want to use the word reward but it's a it's just a positive thing to do with our students and uh, as I was looking through the stickers that I use and of course I take this with me to class and I try to use just the small stickers uh, because they, you can get more out of them and, and they don't use up as much so I've been placing them in there and then I decided to redesign my calendar and when I did that and writing birthdays in I really worked out that I couldn't notice them well and then I found some very small little stickers and I have decided to use stickers as an indicator for family events and birthdays. Now I'm just at the process of re uh, writing out the uh, calendar so I don't have a lot in there but I just thought I would share that with you because um, I guess it's part of the Filofax life and for those who use stickers abundantly and well my congratulations to you and I count myself as one of you now. So not really a tip but just a little update and I would say that uh, as a visual cue to find something quite quickly you can't go past just a small round or colourful sticker. So that's Kent from Oz, thanks for watching and stay tuned for more videos on tips of using Filofaxes.